This is error number nine for the sort of for the MATLAB PC. Now we're going to discuss the say the third type of logical operator, as we said, called the short circuit. The short circuit, I think, is the most familiar operators, which are mostly used with the conditional if and the used also in the same way in other programming languages and the short circuit are mostly used in a scalar level not in the array level so now let's try to explain this this is now a equal to 64 and b equal to 51 so we can write the if a and we can combine them with the relational operator which we are discussing in tutorial number five so if a is greater than b press enter uh, you can write display true enter and then write end to end the operator and we see here the output is true so if we didn't discuss it yet before but i think it is similar to many other programming languages it ends with n and uh, let's try again if a greater than b display true else display false and to end the if we type end so it is true if we change the value or or this type again commands it's a b less than or equal to b and try the same else or we can from here else display false and enter and so it return to false so this type of commands it can be written in a script and to be easier for in managing the code so we will discuss that in later tutorials but today I'm going to show you the short circuit operator which is AND and OR so now let's try to make a new script and write the commands There is also I'm going to show another way to create the script and instead of writing all the commands we already wrote here we let's just close this one and let's just control select the command we want they are from here 
and right click create script so we have them in one script so to run them we just type for example map 9209 yes so let's see the output will be on the command window it is false as we know so now let's try to add another variable c equal to 10 and now let's include the add operator in the editor in the script editor so let's if a is less than b and a is less than c so it is not necessary here to write the brackets this is not like in c plus plus so we can write a is less than b and c and else if a is less than b or a less than c we can write the message a is less than b or less than c so now let's run the program so it returned nothing because a is equal to 64 and b is equal to 51 and c is equal to 10 that means a is greater than both so if we change a to be c and here is c and here is a c b c a and let's run it will there's you have to change also here c c let's run so c is less than b and a and that is true we can look here so this is a brief tutorial how to use the short circuit operator